Parky, bowler of the year, 50 wickets for you this season. How do you assess your 2022 campaigns? Yeah, um, kind of mixed, I think. Obviously, from the team point of view, we'd like to have more success in the red ball. Um, from a white ball point of view, I thought we, we really delivered. Um, disappointing, obviously, not to make quarterfinals in the blast. Um, obviously, with the points deduction, which was massively disappointing. Uh, and obviously, the quarterfinal uh, defeat against Kent in the RL50. But um, hopefully, positive things await. You know, we've got a young, hungry squad that are, are going to work hard this winter and hopefully better things await. Obviously, personally, for you, you took on the captaincy midway through the season in the county championship. How did you find that to, to balance your responsibilities, obviously focus on your own game, but also while captaining and orchestrating in the field? Yeah, if I'm honest, I found it you know quite challenging at times. It was something that I felt like I grew into, um, something that I, was a massive honour when it when it got um, given to me, the captaincy, obviously, in the four-day side, something that I'd, I'd done before and I kind of relished the opportunity. But you know, I'd be lying if I said it was easy. It was... Tough at times to know when to use myself, um, but no, it's something I felt that you know I grew as the season went on, and uh, I thought we played better cricket in the last four championship games, and hoping something that's to build on next year. And after the T20 blast, 20 wickets in that format for yourself, the side obviously quite unlucky not to qualify, having won eight games, but promising signs for the next couple of years with the squad that's developing. Yeah, I think we've got a really exciting uh, T20 side. We've got a lot of options with the ball, and we've got some really dangerous batters. So. I think if we can, you know, get overseas recruitment spot on, Naveen was exceptional. I thought Vian, you know, came in and really balanced the team and, and gave us extra options. So young Rahan was, was outstanding, you know, me and him as a, as a spin pair is, is really exciting moving forward. And, and yeah, you know, we, we showed, you know, time and time again that you know, can challenge the big boys in the North group. So hopefully again, we can go one better next year. An individual accolade for you this season, you presented with your Gold Fox cap all the reward now for the hard work that you've shown ever since you joined across all campaigns how much did that honour mean to you? Yeah it was massive um, not just for me but for my family as well you know really grateful for the club for getting them involved you know to get my family down and, and to witness me receiving the Gold Fox was massive um, something I've strived for something that day in day out I've, I've grafted for and you know I've felt since I joined the club I've you know I've given 100% I've, I've tried to, to you know give my all and, and try and contribute to winning matches for this club and you know, I'm hopeful for a, for a long time doing that.